right, so next up on the list is going to be a, uh, sorry, I'm just recording on my computer. I uh, don't really have a setup yet, so um, it's going to be a credit repair agent that I reached out to on Instagram. Didn't get a response. No worries. Um, so let's call them up. Give me a sec. No, so actually, I reached out to you guys on Instagram. Um, I was actually looking to speak with whoever was in charge of marketing, and I think they told me that that was Alice, um, if I'm not mistaken. I don't know if I have the right person. Um, no, I'm the owner. Okay. Um, would there be any way to, to maybe speak to uh, to them? No, I'm the owner. You're speaking to the owner. Oh, okay, okay. I thought you said that that would be the owner. Okay, perfect. That was easy. Uh <laughs> So did I did I catch you at a bad time or do you have like a second to talk? I have a second. I have a few seconds. Go ahead. Okay. Um, so I mean, if you don't mind, if you could just kind of give me like a better idea of of what it is you guys are doing in terms of marketing, um, just give me like an idea of what's working, what's not working. What I'm doing for marketing right now is pretty much on social media, like Facebook and on Instagram. Okay. Um, can you tell me a little bit more, kind of about about like what what it is you guys are doing? Are you you know specifically, if that's okay with you? Okay. Okay. How is it? Uh, how's it been working for you? Like, have you seen a lot of customers coming in? Yes. Um, we're completely different. Our post is completely different. So um, that's how a lot of people reach out to us. Okay. Cool. Well, uh, what is it? What is it that you guys uh, do differently than most credit repair companies? Um, we post videos that are clients um, that actual results. We do live videos showing that as well. A lot of credit repair company there they don't do that. Okay, so you're more transparent about what it is that you guys do. Exactly, exactly. Okay, cool. That's great because, um, you know, I think I, I think a lot of times, you know, the credit repair industry gets a bit of a, you know, a bit of a bad rep sometimes because, you know, a lot of companies, like you said, don't really show exactly what it is that they do and it gets a little, exactly. you know, a little funky sometimes. So, <laughs> um, so, so mostly Facebook and Instagram, okay. Um, what, what would you say, you know, if, if you could focus a little bit more on, on something in terms of marketing and, and get more customers, what would you say that would be? Um, to be more like outside of social media, because, um, we, um, my office is, is in Houston, Texas. I want to be more connected to the people around the area. Um, I don't want to just deal with people on social media all the time. Sure. Sure. Exactly. So, okay. That makes sense. Um, so, I mean, what what would you say? I mean, you personally, like, what are some of your goals for the business? I mean, do you have uh, you have like any maybe a particular kind of uh, mark where you want to say, okay, I want I want to get this many new clients per month? You know, is there kind of a, a, a you know place you want to get to in terms of that? Yes, I want to get like at least um, I don't know because I, I would have to hire a lot because right now I have like three staff, right? That big um. I have three people working for me for this office. I have two people in Kansas and two people in Florida. Okay. So the, the workload is a lot for me right now, but it will be a whole lot better for me to get more more clients and stuff like that. Okay. Where do you get most of your... I'm the one that work on every file hands-on. Like, they just do the, the basic stuff for me. Oh, I see. Okay. Okay. So, so where do you get most of your leads from? Are they like, do you uh, do you buy internet from, leads or do you? From Facebook. From Facebook. Okay. A lot of referrals, yeah. Nice, nice. Okay, so mostly referrals. That's cool. Uh -huh. So, just a little bit about what I do. Um, I do consulting for for businesses. Um, you know, there's a lot of people that that do something similar to what I do. Um, However, the, the main difference is a lot of people tend to focus more on the social media side of things in, in the sense of, you know, building up your Facebook and building up your Instagram, which, uh, you know, which I think is great. I mean, I love social media and I think it's, uh, for me personally, in my opinion, I think it's more of, it's like a smaller part of an overall uh, marketing strategy. Um, I do, th I do things a little differently. You know, when I, when I work for company, uh, businesses rather, and, you know, if I was to work with you guys. I work strictly with one goal in mind, and that goal is to bring you more paying clients. Um, so, like I said, you know, getting getting engagement and likes on your post and on Facebook and Instagram is great. It's wonderful. Uh, it's nice to have an audience, get some engagement. Like I said, um, but you know, a lot of times it's hard to track just how many new cu uh, customers and clients you're getting from that that kind of stuff. So, like I said, when I you know when I work and and the way I operate is I, I go only with the goal of getting you more paying clients, if that makes sense. Okay, okay. Yeah. Okay. So how, how do you go about 
that. So yeah, what I what I focus on uh, specifically, and this is kind of my bread and butter, and and my you know what I specialize in. Uh, it's Facebook advertising and Facebook advertising, especially the way I do it is a little different. I should say very different than it's different than posting on Facebook. Uh, you know, it's different than, uh, boosting your page. I don't know. I mean, you've probably come across that, you know, Facebook gives you the option to, to boost your Facebook page. What I do is completely different than any of that stuff. Um, you know, what I do and I would, what I would be doing for you guys is, is running highly targeted Facebook ads. Um, to the right people, and I, you know, when I do that, I use a process called hyper targeting. I don't know if other people call it that. I call it that. Basically, it's just making sure that the right people see see the ads that we put out. So it's targeting the right demographic of people, the right age group. You know, people in a in a specific financial bracket. Uh, you know, if you want people coming into the office, we can target uh, people in a specific radius of the office. You know, depending on the location. Uh, a lot more, a lot of other things that go into it. Um, is, it, is, it is it a funnel? You do a funnel or like a funnel? So that a funnel, a sales funnel, is part of what I do. And if that's something that that you'd be interested in having as part of the process. I can definitely do that. Um, so the way I like to set it up a lot of times, and I, what I've found has worked really well, is we run ads on Facebook and we send people from Facebook to a sales funnel, um, which is where basically you'd be getting all your leads, if that makes sense. Okay. Yeah. <clears throat> okay, okay. But how much do you charge for all that? Yeah, so uh, the cost for for this, you know, for what I do, is typically a little higher. It's a little, it's it's typically around a thousand bucks a month. Um, now, what I like to do for a lot of businesses, is, especially when I'm just starting out with them, and you know, what I do for you guys as well, is I would start out, you know, getting started for you guys at about two ninety nine, so it's about three hundred bucks. Um, and the reason why I like to do that is because I like you guys and I like businesses to see that what I do works and that this is something. Uh, that actually works, like I said, and, and it, it will bring you uh, paying clients. I kind of want you to see the process and see, you know, see people coming in and the leads coming in, and you can bring them. Charge two ninety nine per month. Two ninety nine per month to manage the ads, and and um, you know, I don't. I I've had a couple people ask me like, do you charge like per lead or so? I don't. You know, however, if, however many leads we can get, you keep them all. I don't charge you per lead or anything. It's just a flat fee um, per month. Um, and my goal, and what, what my goal would be for you, is eventually for us to to scale up the advertising, meaning we're doing bigger ad volume, um, so we can start reaching more people and getting you more more leads and clients. Um, what what I have to pay for that ad? I mean, what I have to pay for Facebook ads and advertising? Yes. Yeah, so uh, the the ad spend. I you have to pay. I still have to pay Facebook. Yeah. So you would you would decide how much you want to spend in advertising. I will give you a suggestion. Um, what I found works really well is about five to ten dollars a day for twenty days out of the month. I found works really well. Um, when I do it, I don't run the ads every all day every day. I run them at specific times, and like I said, only twenty days out of the month, so that the most people can see them. Um, and a couple things about Facebook that I want to point out that are that's pretty cool actually. So number one, um, and you probably know this already, but just to make it clear, any of the money that you spend on advertising never touches my bank account. It never goes to me. It goes straight to Facebook. Uh, and number two, the cool thing about Facebook advertising is whatever you spend in advertising, they don't actually bill you for until the end of the month, meaning anything you spend, if you spend $200 in advertising, they don't bill you till the end of 30 days. So that's, that's, that's kind of nice about Facebook. Say say it again. I couldn't hear you. I mean, if if we if we pay you for the marketing, why why would we have to pay for Facebook ad and we have to pay you on top of that as well? So yeah, so that that's a good question. So the reason you'd be paying me is because, like I said, I have. You know this. This is my thing. This is this is what I specialize in. Um, is making sure that because it, you know anybody can throw up an ad on Facebook, but it's a totally different ball game and it's a totally different process to actually do it in a way where they are successful advertisements and they actually can you know turn into paying clients for your business. Um, that's a whole nother animal. Um, and like I said, that's what I do. That's what I uh, specialize in, and that's what I can do for you. Um, 
you know, if you're interested. So, yeah, if, if you'd like, it, and this is, you know, once we get started, then we'll schedule a kickoff call where we figure out, you know, how exactly you want to go about doing it. If you want to target people in the Houston area, 100% we can do that. Um, you know, get, you know. Right off the bat, if you want people coming into the office, we can set it up that way. If you want to do it where you have leads coming in through, you know, online and you get them and and you, uh, you know, you want to call them up, that sort of thing, we can do it that way too. It's it's you know, a couple different ways we can go about doing that. Um, so, does that make sense? Okay. So give me about like, give me about like two hours. Let me discuss with my fiance. He stepped, he stepped out of the office. Um, so um, I'm pretty sure he's going to go with it because this other guy charges so much money. Two ninety nine a month will be fair. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. So just give me like, just call me like within two hours. And okay. And just stick to Manny. Okay. You got it. Sounds okay. good. Okay. Okay. All right. Take care. Bye. <sighs> so there you go. That was uh, about a 12 minute call. Um... This is it, guys. It doesn't get much. I mean, if you watch this video, this is all you need. This is it. Um, that was exactly what you need to do. Um, you see, again, I know I've said this, but I didn't go and, uh, you know, this is what I do, da, 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 and I do Facebook, sorry, I'm just grabbing a drink, and Instagram, and, and uh, you know, all this other nonsense. Um, and this is what I can do for you. Blah blah blah. No, first I, you know, I did I, I did a discovery type thing. I, I figured out what what is she doing already? What are they doing right now? Um, in terms of marketing, you know, what's working, what's not working. Um, do they need me? Could they use me? You know, maybe they didn't need me. Maybe they're killing it on Facebook already. Maybe they just know what they're doing. Um, but again, I I figured things out figured out where they are, where they're at, where they want to be. That's another key thing, you know, that's huge. You have to find out, you know, what are your goals? Ask them, you know, as a business, where do you, where do you want to be? How many new clients do you want to get per month? You know, if it's a restaurant, how many new customers? That's a little tough to gauge, but for a lead-based business like credit pair, insurance, stuff like that, CPA, tax people, lawyers are huge. You know, how many new clients do you want? Where do you want to take this? You want to go huge? You want to go big? You want to just stay a medium size, there's nothing wrong with that either, uh, just got to figure this stuff out, you know, and then if what, you know, if they say they want 800 new leads, that, then they're just a little delusional, I mean, it doesn't work that way, if you want, you're going to have to spend a lot more to get 800 leads, so usually they'll give you a pretty realistic answer, and you can say, you know what, that's doable, that's something we can get to, um, again, if they give you a, re a, a reasonable answer, you know, if I want 15, 20 leads, okay, you know, that's doable. We can do that. We can make that happen. But again, you don't come off sounding sales. You don't, oh yeah, we can definitely do that. And I can do that for you. We could do it. No, it's just, yeah, you know, it's something, something we could, we could, you know, definitely get, get going, get, get to, if that's where you want to be. Um, and then you, you, you don't come off as, let me tell you about what I do and how great I am. No, it's just, let me give you a little bit of what I do. And, uh, and then you want them. Here's the key. You want them asking, how do you do it? Okay, you see, I didn't tell them, I use Facebook and the power of Facebook and this is where Facebook is going and how many people are on Facebook and I use it to get you leads. I said, I do it through, you know, I, I, I work with one goal in mind, which is to get you more paying clients. And when they hear that in their head, it's it's like, that, it's to them now you're talking their language. I can know nothing about credit repair. But as soon as I tell them I can bring them more leads and more paying clients, which is more money, now we're talking. Okay, now if I tell them, uh, we could build up your, I can get you 10,000 followers on Instagram. Okay. And where does that translate to money? It's, they can't see it. But if I tell them I can bring you new paying clients and new leads, I'm going to be paying you. It's different. It's a little different. It sounds better. Okay. Um, this is how you close clients over the phone, like a savage. Okay. This is how you do it. So, um, Again, you tell them you bring them more money, bringing them more paying clients. Uh, then you want them to ask, okay, how do you do it? Because okay, they're interested. They want to know. How is this fool that's just calling me up, how is he going to get me more money? And you tell them, I do it through Facebook, advertising, da 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 But I don't sound spammy. You know, it's just a casual conversation. I make sure we target the right people, such and such, blah, blah, blah. And that's it. And then 
you want them to ask. Here's the key. This is another huge thing. Not only do you want them to ask, how do you do it? You want them to be crawling and, and, and be, be knocking down your door to know how much you charge. This is huge. This is key. They don't talk about price unless they ask. I mean, I, I know sometimes they want to ask and you just kind of have to jump into it and say, you know, to get this started, it's such and such price. But if you do it right, you can get them. You should get the, always get the, the, the business asking how much do you charge because they, 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 in their head, they know that what you do is, is working because of the way you talk to them. Like I just spoke to this lady. I sound legitimate. I sound laid back, you know, just like a guy that can help them out. That's it. Um, not salesy. So all these things factor into play. It's just, this is key stuff for you guys. If you want to really get clients over the phone, if you want to get appointments to get the clients, whatever it is, if you really want to do the social media marketing thing, you know, sales is a huge part of it. And this, this stuff here is, is, you know, golden. I hope it should be for you guys. You just got to put it into action and do it and, and use the stuff I'm, I'm doing and showing you guys. So, um, yeah, that's it. You know, they ask you how much you charge and you, and then, you know, as you saw, very important. I didn't say I charge a thousand dollars per month. Okay, no. So you know, typically the cost for this kind of thing is a little higher. You know, it's usually about a thousand bucks a month. Um, but you know, I want to do it for two ninety nine, or I want to do it for four ninety nine, whatever it is. I want to do it for X price because I want you guys to see that it works. And you notice at the end of the call, I hope you guys heard. She said, you know, we're paying a guy now, and we're paying him way more than that, and two ninety nine seems reasonable. I'm, you know, I'm supposed to call him back in two hours. I'm probably going to close this deal today. Um, I'll probably take their payment by the end of today. So this is, you know, this is stuff that works, guys. This is, this is, you know, easy shit once you know what you're doing. Um, so that's it. Um, so yeah, any questions, you know, obviously, uh, you know, comment, comment on the video. I'm, uh, I'm always near my computer, so I'll always be answering, you know, questions and stuff like that. Um, I'm going to leave my email as well in, in the, uh, description for the video. So, um, if you guys ever have any questions about anything, just, uh, shoot me an email, you know, we can always hop on a phone call, stuff like that. So, um, yeah, cool.